Section sixty five of Poems by Currer, Ellis, and Acton Bell. By Charlotte, Emily, and Anne Bronte. This LibriVox recording is in the public domain. Recording by Elizabeth Clatt. An Untitled Poem by Emily Bronte. The following little piece has no title, but in it the genius of a solitary region seems to address his wandering and wayward votary, and to recall within his influence the proud mind which rebelled at times even against what it most loved. Shall earth no more inspire thee, thou lonely dreamer now? Since passion may not fire thee, shall nature cease to bow? Thy mind is ever moving, in regions dark to thee. Recall its useless roving, come back and dwell with me. I know my mountain breezes enchant and soothe thee still. I know my sunshine pleases, despite thy wayward will. When day with evening blending sinks from the summer sky, I've seen thy spirit bending in fond idolatry. I've watched thee every hour, I know my mighty sway, I know my magic power to drive thy griefs away. Few hearts to mortals given on earth so wildly pine, Yet few would ask a heaven more like this earth than thine. Then let my winds caress thee, thy comrade let me be, Since naught beside can bless thee, return and dwell with me. End of section 65